open up photoshop and put your image duplicate your layer with command j once you duplicate your layer come to your pen tool and go up here and make sure it's on path not shape once you are done with that select your beautiful lips or the subject's beautiful lips take your time while doing this don't don't make too much mistake so i'll be fast with this because i don't want us to sleep here yeah? Once you are done selecting your lips, double click and choose make selection. Once you are on make selection, make sure your feather is on 5. So we're going to choose 5 and click OK. Once you are done with that, come over to your solid color. Once you have your solid color, change to whatever color you want to use. So right here, I'm going to be using, let's use purple. I feel purple is good. I just love purple. So let's use purple. I'm going to click on OK and come to your blending mode and choose multiply. Multiply is perfect. If you notice your leaves is not as perfect as you want, you can come over to your brush tool, which you have here. Then come to this layer, make sure you click on this black layer and make sure your fill color is white to review. So I'm going to reduce my brush to a little bit because I want to paint this small space. So I'm just going to paint here. Now it looks perfect. Now double click, double click on this layer right here, then the blending option will come out. Once you have this blending option, come over to this place to blend the light. So you take this part of the underlying layer to your left side. Now you notice what's happening to the lips. Then click on your alt to divide. You divide it, then drag it to blend it all together now you have the realistic lipstick right there so click ok here's the before and here's the after you can come over here to change your color you can change it to any color you want but i'll stick with purple i can make it lighter to make it okay so guys because here is looking so i'm going to use my brush too and i'm going to change this to black to so view then make sure i have the salt box my opacity should be reduced I want to just blend this downside. It's looking too, too thick. Yeah, that's it, guys. This is how you create your realistic, a realistic lipstick in Photoshop. So that's the before and after, before and after. Sorry, I'm going to come over here to just clean some parts here. Yeah, to make it perfect. So here is it. As beautiful as it should be before and after before and after thank you very much and subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this